Hey, hey, welcome to the channel. JB here, excited. This is more of a community than a channel, and today we're gonna help the community stick with those New Year's resolutions. You know, it's that time of year where, you know, we get all excited about what we're gonna do for the new year, and then you go to the gym, you start working out, you start eating right, and then a month from now, you know, you're done, right? It's just like it didn't, you didn't stick with it. And that's what happens to most people when they stick resolutions. In fact, I mean, you go to the gym right now, it's packed. You can't even get it on a machine. In two months from now, the gym is empty. So we want to stop that this year. We want to find that consistency that's really going to help you stick with the resolutions. So the first thing is we got to get a big reason why behind these resolutions, okay? I always say this when I'm coaching. If, if, if a goal doesn't have a why, it's just a wish. Let me repeat that. If a goal doesn't have a why, it's just a wish, meaning it's not going to happen. So let's get a big reason behind everything that we're doing. If we want to lose the weight, why do we want to lose that weight? Dig into that. Is there a reason? Do you want to feel better? Do you want to have more energy? What is the reason that is behind that? Okay, so dig into those reasons why. You want to start a business? Maybe you want to get out of that job that you've had for years, or maybe you want to change the way your life is going. Whatever it is, dig into that reason why so you can call that out when you're starting to fade from the resolution that you've created. Okay, the second thing that we want to do is we want to get around a great community. It's one of the most important things you can do. You know, for years I trained with Mike Lee Kinneric, ex-Israeli Special Forces, and he really got me in great shape. And the reason I got in great shape was because we had a community. We had people getting together and we were making it happen. I think that's why CrossFit works so well is because you work with a group. So find that group. You know, at Morning Coach, we have communities. We've got our Discord community server, and it's so cool as people come together and help each other. So the second thing that you want to do is really find that community so that you can get that support. You're not in this alone, okay? We have a community here on YouTube, so you're not, you're not in this alone. We're here to help you. We want to keep you moving forward. The next thing, do something every day with it. So doing something every day with it is really important. That means we're looking at that small incremental growth. We're trying to lose weight. Do something with it every day. I get it. You need to take breaks, and we'll talk about that if you subscribe to the channel more and more on what we do. But at the end of the day, you've got to touch it every day. If it's something really important to you and you have that big why, you're going to touch it every day. And as you touch it every day, you're going to progress forward. You're going to really keep at it. And that's really critical. You know, this year's a big year for me because I'm focused on not drinking. And as of this recording, it, I'm using a new tool. I'm using uh, I Am Sober, which is an app, and I am on 16 days no drinking. So it just keeps me at it. And every day I look at that and say, okay, you know what? I'm not going to drink today because I want to feel great and have good energy. I'm not saying that's your thing. That's just my thing. So find what works for you and touch it. Do something with it every single day. That way you'll focus on it and it'll keep working day in and day out. Make a plan is the next thing. We want to make sure you have a plan of attack. You know, for a whole year, I took a step away from Morning Coach and built uh, what's called Get It Done Now. And the reason I did that is because I saw people that I would give them ideas to go out and build a lifestyle business or really change their life, and they wouldn't execute on it. They were just getting education. And there's a lot of people that do that here on YouTube. They watch a lot of videos, and it's cool. We're, we're, it's great. But it takes action. You know, the Quakers say, pray with your feet moving. And we got to take action. So we've got to put a plan together and execute on that. And that involves really focusing in on, on getting it done. And if you're, having, you're struggling with this, go over to morningcoach.com. I got the free planner on the website. Start to execute with the structured plan and put that plan together. Work the plan. The plan will help you. If you just stop worrying about the results and focus on the plan, the results will come. Let me repeat that because that was gold. If you just focus on the plan and stop worrying about the results, the results will come. And that's the focus. We need to focus on the activity, not the result. And typically that's what happens and people stop and quit. So let's focus on the activity and get that plan in place. And if you don't have a good plan, go to morningcoach.com and get that free planner. The next thing is to stay positive, okay? And stay self-aware of what gets you down and what, what keeps you going. Like I know that if I'm getting a little depressed, and a little negative, I get like I haven't eaten. I start getting snappy with people. I start thinking people, you know, that there's something wrong with them. And I get really frustrated with people. That's me. I just know that I'm off. And by being off, I got to step back and just pull the throttle back a little bit. So being able to be self-aware is so critical. A few weeks ago, I was on the golf course and I was being a jerk. 
I literally suspended myself from a week from playing because I was like, I need to take a break. Why? Because I was self-aware enough to know. So being self-aware and being positive is so critical when we're going about our New Year's resolutions. Understanding why we feel the way we do. The more we can learn about ourselves, the better off we're going to be when it comes to keeping with the things that are important to us. You may find, and that's why I think it's really important you have a good plan, like with our Get It Done Now plan, it's got a lot of inherent flexibility in it because there may be some changes that need to occur when you're operating within the framework of the plan. And so if you're self-aware, you can make those minor adjustments along the way that are going, that's gonna really help you, okay? So you've got that structure and organization. And the last thing that we wanna talk about is getting involved here, okay? Put a comment in, like the video. Get involved in this community because it will help you. I will help you. I'm here. I'm starting to do these shorts now for fun. I'm doing the videos. Um, I'm having a blast. And hopefully that energy will help keep you going and moving forward in your New Year's resolutions. Look, the truth is we can all progress in the things that we want to do. It's just natural. If we want to go do something, we just got to start doing it and start getting better at it. This is a good example right here. I always do things that are social proof for me. If you look at my business and morning coach and the growth over the years, it was started as a social experiment. Could I take a podcast back in 2005 and leave my career and build a business out of it? Yes. Now, can I build a YouTube channel up that actually grows, helps support people in their mission and grows my business? I'm doing it. It's social proof. So you can see it just by coming here and being a part of this community. That will help you keep your news resolutions. It's about the energy and activity and we can do it together, and I'm here to give you the tools and resources to do it. So let's focus in on it, and let's make this the best year ever. But you gotta be able to really go after it and really make sure we're making it happen, and that's on you. All right, so let's get those New Year's resolutions in place. Let's get big reasons why behind them, because why a resolution or a goal without a why is just a wish. And then let's get that community behind you and help you achieve that life you're looking to live. All right, let's go do it to it. If you're loving this content, give me a thumbs up. It helps with the algorithm. Thank you for smashing that like button. Of course, the subscribe and alert bell if you wanna get this information and continue to get on those New Year's resolutions and being a part of this wonderful community. All right, until the next video, go have a fantastic day.